Oh snap, and welcome back to another part of Let's Play Legend of Zelda Link to the Past. Last time we gathered the Book of Medora and the Ice Rod, and we made our way here to this dungeon. It is the second dungeon. We used the Book of Medora to make a wish on that tablet and open the way and also sell us in. So we have no choice but to venture forth into the dungeon. So let's start this out. Kill you, or not. Oh, these guys go back down into the sand. We kind of came in here at the beginning of, at the end, rather, of the last episode on accident, and I ran back out. So, that was that. So we've already kind of seen the inside. This, can I kill this with a pot? Nope. It's going to shoot me. Oh. Right, so let's go this way. This dungeon's a little weird. I remember it being kind of confusing as to where you go or what you do. I also don't have a key. Oh my goodness. Okay. Got the, oh, okay, so they don't drop. I thought maybe that would drop a key, but we probably just have to go through here. Hmm. Okay, so that's, the, that's a way out if we need to get out and go back somehow. But we are not going to do that. We have no reason to be a quitter. Except for maybe the fact that I'm going to be killed. So let's go this way. Clearly that way is not the way I need to be going. And there's no way to get a key through there. Maybe through here. We need to... Maybe... Okay, obviously the Book of Medora is not going to be helping us beat these monsters. Get some health. Oh boy. Come on, these enemies are kind of annoying the way they come out and go back down into the sand. But they're also not very hard. Right, come at me. Shoot him. And you. Get my arrows back. Okay, so it's giving me magic, so I need to light these. I thought for sure that would do it. I don't know. There's the map. Alright. So let's switch back to our boomerang here. Does that help? Oh. Oh! It doesn't. Let's go this way. Oh. Snap! It's Sahasrala. Sarsaparilla. Uh-huh. Okay. Got to find all the treasure. So I wonder if that key goes back to that door on the other side. Can I beat this? Okay, that's not helping. Oh, boy. I am not having any luck here. Of course, is the last one I pick up. Oh, I can't open it yet, can I? No. Ugh, these rooms. Don't shoot me. Okay, so let's go back and open that key door. I think. Oh, jeez. I need some hearts. No, not getting them. Not for you today, Snap, is what the game says. Not for you. Oh, no! Seriously? Alright, I know where I'm going. I'm done with this. I'm going right back to that key door. I'm not wasting any time. I haven't used my ice rod yet, but I also haven't really have like a good opportunity to, I guess? I mean, I guess I could freeze these guys, but I don't know what good that would do me. Like, okay, let's let's freeze the guy there. Okay, well that, okay. It uses a lot of magic, and it's not like I get a lot of magic either. But then again, it's not like I have a whole lot of health to really mess around with. Alright. Go! Did we go in here? Yes, we did. I think we did. We did not go in here. 
I could really use some help. There's a heart. What? Do you hear that grinding sound? I don't know if that's coming from this room. Um, okay. Alright, here's what we're gonna do. Here's what we're gonna do. Ooh, uh, see how pro I can be. Oh, three out of four. And then I get killed by the last one. Um, okay. That works. Alright, we're ice rotting this guy. I'm not, I'm not messing around. I don't even get anything. That's just a trap room. Alright. This is where we're going. No, we're not looking back. Okay. So you... There's the compass. Okay. So you... So that effectively tells me that you can't kill the statues. Oh, oh, oh! That's what I was hearing. All right. So this is this is what we need to do. Yeah. Let me get the big key. All right. So now we just need to make it out of here alive. Easier said than done. I got hit that time. You guys saw that though. All right. Let's get out of here. So now we can go open that giant treasure chest. And I think I remember where it was. I really am looking for hearts right now. Ah. Uh. Alright, I know where it is this time. I know where it is. That could have ended very badly. Give me an item! The power glove. So... Now that I have the power glove... What does that mean? Can I pick these up? No. You can't even walk into them! That's bullcrap! Uh Okay, so we're back here. And we got the power glove, and I'm getting shot already! Cheese! Cheese and crackers. Cannot handle this right now. Okay. So, I have the power glove. I can't pick those up. I can't go this way. I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing. I I don't know what I'm, where I'm supposed to be going. What I'm supposed to be doing. Remember, I said I played this game before, but it was years ago. And fun fact about this game, actually, I was 14. I was two weeks old, two 14 days old when this game was originally released on the Super Nintendo. So there you go. Now you can figure out what my birthday was. And then you can send me presents. But yeah, my birthday's no time soon. Okay. There's got to be a thing somewhere that I can pick up and throw and make progress. So this is where the key was. I can't. Yeah, okay. So that still hurts me. I'm an idiot. That doesn't hurt them. That doesn't hurt them. <laughs> okay. Well, clearly, I'm just wasting my time. Ooh. Okay, give me this. Maybe there's something down here? Was there not, like, a door down here that I didn't visit? No, I think I did go through here. Uh. Okay. There's got to be something. What's through here? Is it another, like, jump out thing? No? Maybe? Oh, a piece of heart. Okay. 
I hate these vultures. Alright, whatever. Oh, it's gonna hit me. There we go. So clearly there's like... Oh! Look at that. Let's go! We're making progress! Uh. Okay, good, good. Are you serious? Oh, good. Oh, no. Go! This dungeon has been a struggle. We're on the second floor, finally. Okay, so we gotta kill these. I have so many rupees. Look how many rupees I have. I hate these laser beam statues. I, I specifically hate that there's nothing you can do to fight them. Like, you can't, you can't combat them at all. There's also no way to get a key in this room. Oh, gosh. Whoa. Ah! Okay. We can, we can fight the boss with two hearts, no problem. Please give me hearts. Please give me... There's a key. Oh, gosh. Can we, like... It's gotta stop eventually. Oh, for the love of God. I'm coming back to this room. I'll see you in a second. Alright, we're back here. We have three hearts. I'm not worrying about anything. We're going. Okay. Hopefully there's health in here. There is. Look at this. Alright, so we're gonna kill him. And then make some progress. Maybe? I guess we have to light the things. Alright, this is the time we have to light the lanterns. Oh. Uh -huh. Can't catch a break in this dungeon. Yay! Come on. It's taking its time. And now that we have this key, we have full health. We're going to have the bow and arrow, I guess? I don't really know, because I think you have to use your power glove. Alright. Um, this boss. Oh, I remember this boss. I'm going to die. Again. Okay, so what you have to do... Yeah, you have to hit him in the head. And I'm not doing a good job. Let's try the... I don't think the boomerang is going to work. No. No. Okay. Got two. Okay, so the whole thing is you just have to hit him in the face. They burrow out, and they go back. This is kind of a classic boss structure. I mean, we see this even in still in, like, The Binding of Isaac. We saw it in, like, Shadow of the Colossus. It's kind of an... I guess it's like an archaeot... I don't know, it's like a cliché boss. I don't know why I was trying to think about archetypes. Alright. Alright. Oh, come on. Alright, come at me, bros. These things have a lot of health, is what I'm realizing. I think you have to kill them all separately. Oh, and now they're shooting rocks out. Or that one did. Oh, yeah, they are. Alright, so we gotta dodge the rocks they shoot out. Oh! Alright, and we're back for more. On my way back, I thought about a strategy that should work fairly well, maybe. Well, no. I'm using my spin shot. I'm gonna try using a spin shot on them. That way I have to hit them less, because I'm pretty sure spin shots do twice as much. It's like hitting it twice, kind of. Oh, come on. That was just impossible. It's really hard when there are three of them. Oh. And I, I... Did you see that? Like, they all came out. They all came in the same place, and I didn't hit a single one. Alright. And I am, like, in the zone here. Like, I am super focused. I wonder if I can, um... Oh, whoa! 
Okay, I don't want to use up all of my magic, but I do at the same time, so I want to kill him. Okay, I know what I'm doing now. Come straight at me. Okay, well that didn't kill it in one hit like I thought it would. Oh, but it does a lot of damage. Okay, we got this. We got this. Oh, all the rocks. Okay. Oh, I'm going to run out of magic. Oh, man. Okay, so I'm out of magic. We might still be able to shoot it, though. Okay, so there you have it. The ice rod. Totally OP at this boss fight. Oh, come on, stop it! Oh, hit it with the arrow and with my sword. Still didn't die. There we go! Alright, he got me, and then I got him. He needed to chill out. Ha 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 ha! Oh man, that was rough. And as my reward, I get this shiny blue pendant. The pendant of, I'm going to say wisdom. Power. Oh, blue is power? Okay. Only got one more to go. Ding. Golly, that was rough. That was a difficult dungeon. That was, that was, I really struggled a lot more with that dungeon than I should have. Let's get out of the desert. Or not. I don't want the oogly booglies to come get me. What is this? Oh, it's a landmine. No big deal. You know. I bet I can get up there and use the Book of Medora, maybe. So now I can lift. I can't lift these. Oh, I can. Okay. Hey, look what I found. Let's go. Who are you? Check out the cave east of Lake Hylia. Strange and wonderful things live in it. East of Lake Hylia. Can you, like, mark my map? But that would be nice if you did that. I'm just checking to see if the walls are, like, bombable. Oh, there's just money everywhere, so I might as well just get it all. Since we have, like, almost 500 rupees. Almost 500 rupees. And we'll get out here and we'll check my map. And we'll see where east of Lake Hylia... Okay, so is that Lake Hylia? It's like over here, or is this Lake Hylia? And it's over here. Because I think I got the ice rod over in this area somewhere. Wait, what is that? Okay, so the sword's there and the pendant's there. Do I need to return to Sahasrala? I don't, I don't know if I should or not. Instructions were not clear. All right, so I can't lift the black ones. Okay, but I can lift the everything else. Alright, so let's go this way. I don't know. Since I had to, like, use that to... Is there something else over here? Oh, there's a bomb wall here. Okay. Oh, these little things. Um, does the boomerang hurt them? I don't know where I am right now. Oh my gosh. Nope. I, maybe the bow. I'm going to waste all of my arrows. Oh, did you see that? There we go. Sniping. Hey, look, it's you. Take some rubies, but don't tell anyone I gave them to you. Okay. So is this the cave that they were talking about? East of the lake? I don't know. Okay. I mean, I'm not complaining. I'll take it. I had to work for it, though. All right. I'm going to head back to Sahasrala, Sasparilla, and I will see you guys there. Oh, that guy's spinning around like a crazy person. Alright, I'll see you guys back at the Sage.
Before I get back to the stage, I found this cave, so we're gonna bomb it and see what's here. I don't have no idea how long this episode is. Oh, a fairy. Okay, we'll take it. Yay! Thanks, lady. Alright, to Sahasrila. Alright, and we're back here at Sahasrila. Okay, so that's all he says. I just wanted to make sure and be thorough. I wasn't prompted to get back to him, but... Join me next time as we will make our way up to the third pendant, and hopefully then we will start making some progress because then we'll get the Master Sword and then things get crazy. So yeah, I hope to see you there!